too long how I miss my boys from this arc and all that. The final arc of Gintama. My god, this stuff has been absolutely insane. And I feel terrible for not doing this for quite a long while and all that, the chapters. But my god, there's just so much to talk about with 605 and all that. And talking about finally being named at this arc, being named in total. And just the perfect naming of it, the final arc of Gintama being the Silver Soul arc. We've had a lot of great news recently coming out with Gintama. The fact that, you know, like we've been just having so much great ass material and all that from the manga for such a long ass time. And all we had this, my god, insanely beautiful. And honestly, seeing that is like one of my favorite like jump issues like all together. Seeing that cover right there of Gintoki there, the one who laughs at the scenery of the end. And even with the announcement of we're getting a brand new anime to adapt the final stuff of the series and all that, which makes me goddamn happy finding that, knowing that the whole series is gonna be fully adapted, and just this chapter as well being monumental, just insane and all that, for what we've seen in Gintoki, and just, I, I love just the, like, straight up color spread that we got for the series and all that, as you say, it says, stand up samurais, and seeing everyone together, like, with the, the all the burn, like, around the, like, of what we've seen of the Yoris, and everything, like, of the, like, area that they live in and all that, and just seeing them all standing up, uniting as one is like no we're gonna take this down and we're gonna like stand up for what we think is right and i just i just love it so goddamn much in this chapter straight up being probably near one of my favorites of the entire series and all that but surely mainly because of that ending which we're gonna get right into with that shinsen gumi returning kondo hijikata and sogo returning so we straight up start off this chapter we get to see like kagura shinpachi ginto everyone is just like fucking absolutely wrecked after the explosion that they chose took and right through like the inferno we do get to see Gin and Nobume just come out of like the inferno completely wrecked up and all that it's like you saw that Nobume was trying to push Gintoki out of the way but she like made sure to grab her out of there even though she's pretty wrecked as well it's saying like, you know we can't have you die not after everything that like happened or that like, not what Sasuke did to you nor like you're his living legacy we cannot have you die in a like place like this and she's just like <laughs> like I'm guessing he's laughing already or like from up there and all that thinking about that and it's just those piece of shit like fucking yeah like you are like just going up in the sky it's just like oh we like we took care of everything no just burn everything to the ground just burn it all and all that it's still there don't you see burn all of it down i'm like oh my god this piece of shit i hate that he just came last second he's like no we need something and all that to cleanse our anger and our souls and we know what we're doing is wrong but we need something because these guys won't die and i hate the fact that he's doing this all the time it's just like we do not need this we need everyone uniting trying to take down one single foe but it's like it isn't helping that all of this is happening at once and then the fact that actually like Soyo comes out as like all like the magistrate like they're all talking saying oh we should have surrendered already like you know she could you know you know he like and all that like since we lost him and all that and now Nobu Nobu was like like he should have surrendered it's like whatever we to do with Lost and all that, and Soyo, a little girl of all things and all that, is the one that has to appear and calm everyone down, and she's like, regardless of what, I'm like, I'm his little sister, regardless of what, I am like part of the royal, like royalty here and all that, and that I'll be taking things under like charge, I, I love that, like she's really stepping up and all that, and I love, like I can just kind of picture like the ending of Gintama, we could actually see like a big time skip where she's actually like become fully, like she's in charge now, and she's like probably grown up to be like, you know, like a wonderful leader. I absolutely love if that's like the case that's going to be happening with her and all that. Even if like Nobunobu like takes on the like wing for a little while and like actually gives it up to give it to her. I really absolutely love that for like like that's what we're going to be having. And we even have the fact that it's like even though Zenzo is now going to like say like you can do whatever you want. Well, I don't care but it's, like, you can do it as like his little sister and all that and not as princess. Like I'm going to do whatever the hell I want and all that. And it's like that thing's like you know Zenzo's going to go back there. He's going to help his own. He's got to deal with some stuff and all that. Like which I really appreciate. And the thing was especially interesting interesting is that they were like as they were running like across the streets and all that we got to see with Gintoki is that he's just like god damn it like he's just like so pissed off and all that is like he's like thinking like you know like I'm still like like am I starting to give up honestly am I starting to like feel like all of this is pointless mainly for the fact that you know like we I've not even been able to like like reach my sword once to this man and all that like you know like I hadn't even taken one step forward since like I was a kid back then after everything I've done and all that have I like honestly just been like doing the same path that like the, like, the entirety of like really not grown since that time and like honestly just seeing the fact that they've got tanks chasing after them they're running and they're like we're trying to hold 
on and the fact it's like like we immediately trying to hang on it's like quick we need to get out of here and all that like and it's just like they're being surrounded and it's just like he's carrying the boomy he's all bloodied up he's like all beaten up and it's just like right I, we have even if we have to run and run away we, we're not it uh, feels like we're not reaching anything and it's just honestly when you see like fucking in Toki when he's like holding in and like Gin like, like after like you know like what well, he's just there he's just looking just defeated like Kaga and Shimpachi are looking at him and like saying like have we got nowhere to go like like what are we gonna do and it's just like Gin's Hoki just generally looks like he's giving up and it's just like I can't do anything. I, I can't beat this man. I can't do anything about this. And it's the last minute hope where it's like, so they scream out. It's like, it ain't over yet. Face forward. Grab your swords with us like that. Fight on your own. And you see Kondo, Hijikata, and Sogo appear after so long. Look him fucking badass as fuck, may I add. New coats, new suits, and all that. Like, I absolutely love that. And like, him standing up on top with his big, massive scar on his face. And it's like, that like, is picking their swords. And it's like, that is a badass way and all that. Like, people have been waiting for chapters upon chapters. It's honest, I, I'd like to say it's been so long since we last saw the Shinsengumi. Like, we haven't seen them for nearly around about two arcs at this point, and it's like, it took chapter 605 to finally have these guys return to, like, the main story, and that's absolutely insane for the fact that it's taken, like, almost this long and all that to see them, appear, like, appear in the story once more, and I, I absolutely love that that's the case and all that. It's like, I'd, I'd like to say, honestly, it's generally been around about, like, about eight, I'd like to say it's about been about like 70 yard chapters or so since we last we last saw, uh, saw them. Like I, I, that's absolutely ridiculous when you think about it, since they're such huge characters at the end. Like if you think about it, and it's just like the fact that they haven't been like there for over a year and a half's worth of material and all that. That's that's insane for those people. I like, just think it's like, oh my god, we haven't had them in there for so long and all that. Like what the hell are we gonna do and all that? We need them in there now, 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 now. And it's just like I, oh, I'm so happy to see like some of my favorite characters right uh, my boy and all. Like Hijikata, Sogo, Kondo, like like all like the squad is there and all that, and they're like we know exactly like they came at the right time to give Gintoki hope. The same thing what they did like the other way around. I like how like now the shoes on the other foot. Like, like you know after everything that happened like Gintoki was like during like that whole arc and all that with the fell where like Shinsen Gumiga and it was just like no he was the one that was giving them hope when they thought like they couldn't save Kondo where they was like losing it and it's just, I love that. It's like you know it's come full circle now and it's just uh, it's so great and all that when like Gintoki Toki was just getting hope and it's like, we need you, man. Like, this is not the time to be giving up. And surely, like, it, it's like, I absolutely adore this chapter. I know there are a lot of chats as you can say. It's like, this is my favorite Gintama one. But it's like, this one's up there as well. I absolutely love this one from start to finish and all that. But let me know you guys think in the comment section down below. What did you think about this Gintama chapter? How did you think, like, how monumental it is and all that? And can you not wait and all that? For this and all that being like the final arc and all that, like, can you not sit, wait to see like how this climaxes and all that? Personally, I want it to be as slow as possible because I want more Gintama in my life. But I'm glad at least that we're gonna get a proper full conclusion in the anime. And I'm I'm straight up important this like uh, sh Shonen Jump issue. I need this and like like I that like cover is sheer like just uh, like just amazing. And I need this chat doing my like I need the physical version of that because I'm not gonna lie that actually gets me a little bit emotional when I think about that cover and like what everything that kind of stands for. And it's just like seeing Kentucky at the end and all that and the silver soul arc it's just a perfect like finale like to be calling it and all that thank you very much for watching as always and all that let me know you guys think uh like for, in the comments down, like, down below what you thought about it but that's all from me so i'll see you guys though in a bit